Welcome to Sleepless News. Olympic rider on Kaskun left in tears in the pentathlon after Spooktor St. Paul refused to jump, with nightmare score of zero and in her dreams of a gold medal in Tokyo despite her leaving before the event. Anika Skou's hopes of winning a medal in the pentathlon were ended in harrowing fashion after her horse St. Paul refused to jump. Skou, representing Germany in Tokyo, entered the event with a commanding letter and looked set to clinch the gold emphatically, but she then quickly plummeted down the rankings after the equestrian leg. Her horse appeared scooped before and after entering the arena, and aimlessly made his way around the challenging course while refusing several jumps. Coverage seemingly showed an emotional screw, 31, in floods of tears before even beginning her performance. While on top of her mount, she looked to get the panicked Saint Boy to cooperate using her whip. Having then made their way into the arena, Sklu set about attempting to salvage her dreams of a podium finish. However, Despite the horse clearing four sets of hurdles to begin with, he then collided with the fifth. That brought a rapid end to her lead, and St. Boy then buckled despite Sklu looking to guide him around the course for another go. In the end, she was made to finish with zero points, leaving her rock bottom. Having narrowly missed out on a medal in Rio 2016, after finishing fourth, Sklu was again left devastated. Her tears were broadcast for all to see as St. Boy jumped around, remain in alarm and in no fit state to compete. She had held the equivalent of a 24 second advantage after the fencing and swimming legs, but fell out of contention for silverware for the lesser round. But Samantha Murray, an Olympic silver medalist and world champion, believes that the nightmare nature of the performance came about largely due to writer error. When you try to break it down, you can see that it's largely writer error, the mistakes, she said. I think she was quite put off, because when this horse first went into the arena in the first round, she was eliminated on this horse. That probably set a bit of a panic off with this athlete. So when she would have gotten on this horse, she would have been a bit stressed. That transcends into the horse. Horses can't see the rider, they can only feel you when you're on top. You need composure, and you need to be very decisive with what you're going to do when you're riding. In the moments when she was crying and panicking, I understand why she was like that. But you just wish she'd let the reins loose a bit and rode more with her leg. Really give the horse as much positivity as possible. Ride forward. Encouragement. You saw, when she came to the fences correctly, the horse jumped. When she came on the wrong stride, not quite there, not quite close enough, the horse stopped, because the horse was losing confidence all the way through that. These horses need to feel as confident as possible with you, an unknown rider to them. The chaos saw Great Britain's Kate French claim gold, in what is Team GB's first triumph for 21 years in the event. Thank you for watching. Like, Share and subscribe to Sleepless Buddy. See you next time on Sleepless News.